Hey mom, it's about 3.08 Wednesday, and uh, I just had lunch, so I figured, uh, you know, on my day off, I went to Burger Supreme. It's known for the pastrami, so I went ahead and I got myself a pastrami burger. It was it was pretty decent. It wasn't the best, but I mean, it was, it was better than most that I've had. Uh, right now, um, I'm gonna take you around town, but first, before we go around town and I show you kind of what we got, uh, we gotta go to Jamba Juice. So that's where I am right now, and uh, I'm gonna go get me something. All right, so I went ahead and I got a Caribbean Passion. I actually got a medium, but because I said please and thank you, they actually accidentally made a bigger batch and gave me a bigger cup. So thank you for that, teaching me um, to say my manners and all that. Uh, so let's go and take a look around town. Um, it's still new to me, so let's go. So first stop is Center Street. Center Street runs down the center of the town and it's kind of like uh, like strip mall. So I mean, there's gonna be a ton of businesses, a ton of cool restaurants and a ton of cool things. The first place I actually wanna take you is the uh, Provo City Temple. Um, I really think you're gonna like it. So we're gonna get out. It's a three minute walk if that and let's go. All right, so this is like one of my favorite places to go after work is uh you see that there that's it that's the provo city center temple i believe it's called um beautiful immaculate building and actually the uh, the gates are open when i came here after work they're actually shut so uh it might be cool to see if we can get a little closer so i just remembered something um after work i usually have you know pants a nice dress shirt um for work but today i'm in leisure clothes and so I don't think I want to walk up onto the temple grounds in street clothes. So that'll have to be, you know, something next time. But I can take you down Center Row, or Center Street, I guess, and we can see what it has. I still am learning what it has, too. You'll love this, look, they have all your British stuff, you know, that you like. We even have Cadbury eggs. Is that a giant Kit Kat Cadbury egg? That's 10 bucks. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Like, gift. Reminds me of my old work. You know, it's a pharmacy that also has other things in it. Is there anything good here? Oh, we sold that exact thing. It's funny. Huh. Well, there's not much in here, so I'm gonna buy this. So, um, I had to take video, well I wanted to take video, but I had to take photos because they started playing music and, uh, you know, since I'm going to put this on YouTube, I actually want to use the, the, uh, the video. So, it's called Swamp City Eats. It's inside, um, Platinum Music Sports and Collectibles. <laughs> the guy there, his name is Skinny Pirate. He's the coolest dude. Um, hopefully I got some pictures to show, you know, like, like what's in it, but it had anything from, like, records to, uh... Like sports memorabilia, to it almost looked like a pawn shop with a whole um, like food in it, or food in it. It looked like how do I explain it? it looked like there's a deli, right? And and it was more of an LA vibe, so it was actually pretty cool to see that you know like some LA vibes were here. Man, my hair's a mess <laughs> here in in, in uh, Provo. So um, there's gonna be a free band there Friday, this Friday actually. So maybe I'll stop in and see if I can get a little bit of, of some video about it but man my hair uh, so that was a cool find some cool guys in there definitely gonna want to try to stop back um, so right now I have this 
I have this Cadbury egg I've been carrying around, the Kit Kat Cadbury egg. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and walk back because I don't want it to melt. So in traffic, not really traffic, I mean, come on, what's traffic? Three, four cars on a left turn. So uh, hopefully that was, uh, you know, it's the first video. So I mean, if, if it was really bad, give me, cut me a break. I'm gonna get better. Um, but the plan right now is I'm gonna drive home and uh, not gonna show that because I don't think I want a bunch of people to know where I live in town. It's not the biggest town. But anyways, um, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go back and I'm going to open up this Cadbury egg and uh, see what it's all about. Um, man, it, this is a fun little town. I, I can't wait to show it off properly. Um, you would hate it only because, you know, there's, there's some traffic circles. There's actually quite a few traffic circles. And then most of the left turns are non-aero left turns. So you have to hide, in, well not hide, but you have to get in the middle of the intersection uh, to make your left. And I don't know if that would bug you as much as the traffic circles, but yeah, there's, there's quite a few traffic circles. Um, one of them is it's a traffic circle into another traffic circle, which I know would uh, make you so happy. <laughs> But uh, the the grid-based system is still interesting. I'm still getting used to it. So for those that might not know, Utah doesn't necessarily have it, kind of like, well, at least in California, where you have your building number and then followed by a street name. In this case, it's your building number with the cross street. So for instance, if, if uh, I'm coming up to 300 North, so if your building number was 580, it'd be 580, 300 North. And if you're not used to that, then you would have almost no idea um, what that even means, and even if that's that's English. So, um, yeah, it's it's crazy to me that that's how they do things. But hey, that's how they do it. Um, it's, you know, it's about 75 degrees, and you know, I know it's it's probably hotter everywhere else, and you're not even you're like what? That's not even that hot. We were in the 50s with rain, and then the next day it goes up into the 80s. So there's these 30 point degree shifts, and man, does it suck sometimes, especially with no AC. Like right now, to record this video, um, I have my windows rolled almost all the way up, so you can hear me. So I'm sweating. So if you see sweat rolling down my my eyebrow, just just ignore it, just so I can make you these videos, which I plan on making more. If I do anything else fun today, I'll definitely be sure to, to at least take some video, if not record it. Um, and I can show you kind of my work maybe next time. Um, show you that commute, because I'm sure that, that would be fun to see. Maybe not, but hey. There's just, there's, oh, those people get in an accident? Oh yeah, they did. Yep, and they're exchanging information in the left turn lane without getting out of it. Oh man, those poor people. Um, so that being said, I'm almost home. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and cut the recording here. Uh, just gotta get over, make my right, and then time for the Cadbury egg, right? I think it's gonna be so much fun. All right, see you in a sec. You know, I just, I thought of something. Um, I've been taking a lot of this video, you know, up and down, which it's gonna make the video resolution look really wrong. And you, you should know, um, you know, me being the kind of guy when it comes to video and photography, I'm always the one that's like, turn your phone sideways. And here I am breaking my own cardinal rule. Um, <laughs> so, so hopefully um, the video quality is pretty high, um, pretty high resolution so I can kind of zoom in a little bit. Um, but I'm gonna have to remember, see this is all learning um, about how, how to do everything. I'm trying to see like, what's, what's a good angle? Like, I don't want you to, like, me to look down, you see, like, my quadruple chin. But at the same time, I don't want you to, like, look up my nose. Hey, look, green. All right, just thought about that. So, oh, I'm in the floor of my living room. <laughs> this looks like the most, you know, like... <laughs> look, I'm single, okay? I have a roommate, so, I mean, this is what our living room looks like. So, this is a, a Nestle... Kit Kat. Oh, it's Nestle, not Cadbury. I got all excited. But it has one large egg and two full-size crunch bars in it. Well, I'm kind of sad it's not Cadbury, but I didn't know who else would make something like this. Is the egg even like... Okay, it is in a little fun. Like, what the heck? Oh, I think it's a little melted. So maybe we won't open it. 
But in theory... There we go. I'm shaking it, I don't hear anything inside. Oh! It's not even inside! Boo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. So it's just a crunchy egg? I only have the one hand. Yeah. Oh! It's not even... Oh! That is not even Kit Kat chocolate. Oh! So, I spent $11 with tax for two Kit Kats and a really close chocolate egg. <laughs> so, yeah. Ten, most ex $5 Kit Kats, most expensive Kit Kats I've bought. Don't look in there. Why are you trying to look in there? There's nothing in there. It's the weirdest thing. You see my computer. Whoop. Right there. Wow, I can't... Directionally, I can't make sense. There's this weird table thing that leads into the kitchen. So, I don't have a desk, so that's where I put my computer. <laughs> Never mind the, the living room. It's just where we store stuff right now. So, um, that's going to be that for today. Uh, if anything helps, you know, happens after this, then I'll definitely make um, another video based off of that. But, I just figured I'd show you really quickly around town, Mom. Um, I know there's more I need to show you, and I will. So I guess this is gonna be the easiest way to show you. Uh, so stay, stay tuned for that, and anyone else that wants to follow the journey along, it's gonna be kind of like a vlog, but hey, I don't know yet. All right, I love you, Mom. Bye!